On Friday from the Mall of Asia Arena in the Philippines, 1FC put on their ninth installment and the event was live here on Fight Network. In the main event, 1FC featherweight champion Hanario Benario took on former lightweight king of pancreas Koji Oishi. Despite being the much less experienced of the two, Benario took control early on, stalking his opponent around the cage and landing combinations. Oishi was not putting up much of an attack until he caught his opponent with a single right hand that dropped him. The tough Benario was able to get up and turn the tables as he attacked Oishi and scored a knockdown of his own. In the second, both fighters started out cautiously, but it was Oishi who landed with another big right hand that dropped his opponent. Only this time, the Japanese fighter went in for the kill. And Benario... Oh, what a big punch! And this could be it! It is it! With the victory, Oishi captures the 1FC featherweight title and hands Benario his second career defeat. In the co-main event, current Dream Bantamweight champion Bibiano The Flash Fernandez faced off against 8-2 Japanese fighter Kotetsu Okazaki for the 1FC interim Bantamweight title. The story of the fight was complete control by the Brazilian as he was able to close the distance and take Okazaki down in every round. Okazaki proved to be tough as he fought off numerous submission attempts but did not put out much of an attack. After five rounds were completed, the judges gave the unanimous decision to Fernandez, who now holds two belts from two different organizations. Also on the card, it was the finals of the 1FC Bantamweight Grand Prix as former featherweight Shudo champion Mazakatu Ueda took on the 18-2 Kevin Balingong. Balingong displayed great kickboxing abilities as he punished Ueda with kick standing. However, the 35-year-old was able to score takedowns and get good position on the mat. Balingong continued to score heavily on the feet and even damaged his opponent. However, Ueda kept the fight close with more takedowns and submission attempts. After three rounds, the unanimous decision was given to Ueda, who comes out on top in the Bantamweight Grand Prix. In another battle, former UFC and Pride veteran Phil Baroni battled karate champion Nobutatsu Suzuki in a welterweight affair. Baroni came at Suzuki throwing heavy shots and displayed his wrestling, while Suzuki looked to land left hooks to the body. At the 47 mark, Suzuki unleashed an attack on the American with knees and punches, which finished him. With the TKO win, Suzuki gets his 10th career victory.